Good morning, class 10. I welcome you all in the social science class. How are you all? I hope you all are pretty well. From today, we will start the civics book. And the name of the lesson is Outcomes of De Democracy. <clears throat> we will start with this. Because in this month, we have to cover our syllabus. And in the same uh, month we have a second pre-board so we have to cover the syllabus first then we will go for the revision so let's begin with this lesson outcomes of democracy <clears throat> outcomes of democracy uh, this is nothing new for you because we have studied about democracy in our class 9th and in the same in this class class 10th so, uh, this is just a revision. You can say only few more points will be added in this chapter. Otherwise, there is nothing new in this. So, let's start. Why is democracy a better form of government? Why is democracy a better form of government? Now, the answer for this question is democracy promotes equality among people. You can write all these points in uh, the question for uh, characteristics of democracy or you can say write the advantages of democracy write few points in favor of democracy if all these questions uh, come you can write the answer you will write the same answer for for all those questions also ki democracy a better form of government kyun hai kyun hai dekhe Democracy promotes equality among people. In the eyes of democracy, we all people are equal. There should be no discrimination. Enhances the dignity of the individual. Enhances means badhana. Wo individual ki dignity ko respect ko badhata hai. Because we all have the right to vote. We all have the right to elect our representative. So we all are equal. So it enhances our dignity. Improves the quality of decision making. Now see how democracy improves the quality of decision making. Uh, for this you can uh, say that uh, in democracy government may take decisions very fast. But it may take decisions that are not accepted by the people and may therefore face problems. And uh, democratic government will take more time to follow procedures before arriving at a decision. Because uh, before any, uh, any law, when a law comes in a physical form to implement, it has to go through many steps. So, it takes time. The, the government, uh, democratic government will take more time to follow procedure before arriving at decision. Because it has followed procedure, its decisions may be more acceptable to the people and more effective. So, provides a method to resolve conflicts. Conflicts means, if you think that there is a problem somewhere, then there are many methods to conflicts ko resolve karne ke. Unko, uh, unke solution ke bohut sare methods hai. Allows room to correct mistakes. Par hum, hume ek mauka deti hai ki hum koi mistake karte hai, to hum usko correct kar sake. Kaun deti hai ye sab? Democracy. So, democracy is a better form of government. Point number six. It is a legitimate government. Legitimate government, uh, why it is a legitimate government? Because it is elected by the uh, by people it is slow less efficient and not very responsive or clean it is slow because it has to go through so many procedures uh, for making any law so that uh, other governments say other form of government say that is it is very slow it is people's own government yes the democratic government is people's own government because, because our leaders are elected by, are selected by we, the people of the country. It has its own ability to generate its own support. 
and democratic government has its own ability to generate its own support. So that is why democracy is better form of government. Next is what are the outcomes of democracy? Outcomes means a result. Democracy is just a form of government. So you can uh, write in this question that democracy is just a form of government. It can only create conditions for achieving something. Democratic government create conditions for you to achieve something. Citizens have to take advantage and achieve goals. And it depends on our people. It depends on the citizens of the country to take advantage of that condition and achieve your goals. So these are the outcomes of democracy. So that's all for today. Tomorrow we will continue with the next part of the lesson. Thank you class. Have a great day.